Today we are discussing current division rule. This current division rule only applicable for parallel connected elements only. They are resistance, inductance and capacitance. Resistors are connected in parallel. For example, two resistors R1, R2. V voltage is applied to the circuit and I current is flowing. From resistance R1, I1 current is flowing. From resistance R2, I2 current is flowing. Now we can find out the I1, I2 by using current division rule. Here, voltage division rule is not applicable in parallel circuit. Why? Because voltage in each element is same here. We want to find out the I1 current. Total current into opposite resistance R2 by total resistance. Next, I2 current. Total current into I2 current find out just now. Opposite resistance R1 by R1 plus R2. Example 4 amperes current source 4 ohms 2 ohms. These are two are parallel connected with 4 amperes. Here you want to find out the resistance value. You want to find out the I1 and I2 by using current division rule. How how can we can find out I1 is equal to total current 4 amperes opposite resistance 2 ohms by total resistance 4 plus 2. And this one again. 4 by 3 is the final answer. And next I2 current we find out. This element is current we find out. Total current 4 amperes into opposite resistance 4 ohms by total total resistance and the 4 plus 2 and the 16 by 6 and 8 by 3 was okay now ila manamu each element the gata manu current and find out just some parallel connector capacitors this kone manu show them ela current find out just some two capacitors are connected parallel c1 c2 and the voltage v is applied to this circuit i current is flowing and here i1 current is dividing i current is dividing with i1 i2 one matter we want to find out the i1 current i1 current means total current into you want to find out this i1 current so that capacitance by total capacitance i2 total current into I to find out just now. E capacitance C2 by total capacitance. Okay. I1 I2 which is the By using current division rule, we want to find out the I1 I2 current. This is the one we find out just now. Example. Six amperes. Current source. Four farad. Four farad. 6 amperes and divide with I1 ga, I2 ga. and divide I1 and I1 find out chayante. total current 6 amperes ga. into e resistance and I1 flow sorry resistance ga, capacitance 2 farads and by total capacitance and 2 plus 4 and 2 plus 4 6 but and those the manake 2 amperes was the okay now next I2 find out chayante. and the Total current to 4 amperes by so 4 farads by total capacitance 2 plus 4 and those are 4 amperes. Each capacitance is the current and the flow of the current by using current division rule. <coughs> Thank you for watching.